Alright, we're going to film a spin only video in the Hoover Top Loader. As this is probably the only thing I'll ever film on this because you can't really see inside this machine, so I won't really film any videos of it. Um, but I will give you a spin only just so you can see what it's like. Uh, this machine was my grandma's. I don't know if you all remember it from my, my old channel because I used to have my old channel. That was the door slammed because of the wind. Um, I don't know if you would have uh, seen it on my old channel. Or well, King of Spin Drives one, but I used to film this machine not very often, but I did every now and then. But I've gave her the Samsung AI now for this machine. So, yeah. So we're going to use this first and only. I am keeping it, as I know so far. Should I put a few cloths in it just to you know, maybe make it a bit unbalanced? Probably won't make it unbalanced though, because there's so many cloths. I don't know how the angle is, but as you, as you can't see, I guess I could pit the door lock on it to get it to go, but I ain't doing that now. So we're going to do a 1400 spin only in it. Can't see where spin only is, it's a bit dark in here. That's it, right here we go. Yeah, you have to push on the lid a bit on it now as well, it's a bit dodgy. Yeah, this is just to give you an idea what it's like then. It's tucked away in the corner as well, I'll show you. It's, that's what it is, tucked away in the corner. Right, anyway. Enjoy. Actually, I might sit with it a second, see how much it shakes. So I'll put a few items in it because I just want to see how much it'll shake. So the problem with this machine that it's got, it's got a, um, it's got a leak from somewhere. Now it has overflowed at the top a few times, you can see them there, but I think that's just from being overloaded too much for like massive blankets that's used to washing it. Sounds like I ought to take them, no problem there. But I need to figure out what's leaking, because apparently it should leak something underneath it, just, just everywhere. I'm hoping it's just something to do with the salt or something, because that would be easy to fix it, but I'll have to have a look, but I've plumbed it over here just so I can, you know, keep it running in the cold. Sounds a tiny bit rough because it ain't been used for a while. This spin should do it good though. It's just a little kick strip at the bottom as well. I need to try and find that. I'll put it, I'll put it in my grandma somewhere, if, if anything. So next time I'm going to try and put it in the man. It just falls into it. I bet this door shake open. No, you don't. Next day should. This scares me. I can get this thing because it's too bad. Just get your watch front. Stop here, and then it'll go again. Put the uh, scrub daddy bags around so. I haven't used this water yet, so I don't know how to really. I don't know I'll put it over there though for a water test. I'll probably drink it back out for a water test. I'll just move the 58S over, drag it out to where that is. So I can look all the random machine and what it's for. <laughs> oh, no, 
bending some this guy must have cut that so it's how's that growth there? I haven't done anything. Oh that's a crack man, I haven't even done anything to it. It's just sat there. Sad I didn't have cheese here bad man. Plastic so bad on it. More turn it around so it's a bit. Speed for ages now, the other for a bit. Fine.
all about the loop that was on. That little noise you hear at the bottom plate, it was really loose at the bottom. I need to try to get that off. That is ridiculous that thing. The, uh, it's the uh, it's the bottom plate on it. Yeah, that's what I'm talking about. Yeah, Too bad over here, though. It's got to go for fast yet, though. It's only 12. Some to stop now, anti crease, fix the bomb off. Okay, the swim bloody jack bags around. That is pretty cool, though. I ain't gonna probably end up getting rid of this machine, I'll probably go keep this to us. It's quite a child of this machine, as well. So, what I'll do is I'll just probably keep it in that corner. It won't be used much, obviously, because it's not very interesting to watch. Um, if I do use it, I'll probably end up having another machine or something with it, just so 
I've got something else to watch while that's doing its thing. Uh, but it'll stay over there and I can use it whenever I want, really. Until I fix the damn leak issue. Hopefully I have something to do with the tub, because that'll be quite interesting to repair that one. So I'll need to find a tub for this machine. And then, then fit it. Or maybe I could like silicon it up with some special like leaky stuff. Cause I've seen people use stuff like that on like crack drums before. There you go, not a very long door lock. There you go, and then the, this lid doesn't no, no, Oh yeah, it does fix itself. So before you had to push it down and lift it up, and it just pops up. Yeah, that's the uh, that's the lid. So the mechanism works. It just pulls up and down. Here you got your turns, so that's soften that's main wash. Softeners over at the end. And yeah. You can take this thing off, which I have done a couple of times, so when I clean it over I'll just take the whole freaking cover off because the whole machine is a clean, it's filthy. Where's the lid? There it is. Over here's the little jet mechanism behind the door. That's in there, that's the mechanism. That's how it wets it down. And yeah, it's quite deep in there, but... Yeah, that's what it looks like inside. So it's quite a cool little machine, to be honest. It's only a 6kg drum, as you can see there as well. But it's quite a cool little machine, to be honest, and it's got quite a good power for what it is. So it probably will be staying with me. I like machines like this. I just wish, maybe if I can find like a plastic cover to put over the top of it, so I can use it with the lid up then. But I'll have to put something over the top, like a window or something, just so I can see inside it and just cover the door lock up with something. But I have to pick the lock or something. Yeah, there we go. I hope you guys enjoyed that video. Just a little video. Probably won't be another video of it, but you might hear it going like the background of like other full cycles, but. That's it for today and yeah, I'll see you later.